So here we have a quick demonstration of our stepper motor test board for our 40i6 final year project. Uh, it's a fairly straightforward board. It just adapts the STM32 discovery board to um, a stepper motor driver, an Allegro A4988, through this intermediate board. Uh, the design of the intermediate board is up here. It's fairly straightforward. There's a few caps on it and um, an option for resistors. We have one LED that indicates whether or not the stepper motor is enabled and another LED to indicate uh, whether or not the motor is stepping and those are hooked directly up to the pins on the uh, STM32F4 microcontroller. If we take an oscilloscope and probe the step pin you can see that we're currently applying a square waveform to the stepper motor and every rising edge of this waveform uh, tells the motor to move forward one step. So if we go ahead and turn the power on to our circuit you can see that the motor is enabled and then it starts turning which is exactly what we expected. So you can see right now I'm trying to stop it from turning and I can't but when it's disabled it's fairly easy to turn so obviously our motor driver is working correctly. Right now we're driving it at about one amp so 500 milliamps per coil and we're also running at about 10 volts. You can see that if we turn up the voltage that we have louder and louder steps. Now we're at about 18 volts. This is because the stepping motion is faster and more abrupt. So we'll go back and leave it at 10 volts which seems to be getting us a decent uh, performance from our board. Uh, the next step that we have to do is implement uh, acceleration and uh, stepping through the use of timers.